Well, it hasn't even been a week since the rainbow crosswalks were installed in Knob Hill and they've already been vandalized. A motorcycle group burned out at the intersection last night, leaving behind hard to remove skid marks. As News 13 Stephanie Chavez explains, the LGBTQ community feels specifically targeted. Stephanie is live tonight in Knob Hill. Dean Brittany, the crosswalk here at Central and Morningside went up on Monday, just in time for the Pride Parade this weekend. And the LGBTQ community says the act of blatant disrespect is exactly why they celebrate Pride. This act, though trivial, though frustrating and though absolutely immature, still sends a very clear message of why Pride is so important 50 years after Stonewall. Now, Albuquerque police say they're unsure if the vandalism was targeting the LGBTQ community, but members feel victimized by the destruction. This weekend is the annual Pride Parade along Central, and June is Pride Month. Candelaria encourages those responsible for the jam damage to go out and enjoy the festival. He says he hopes they'll gain an understanding of what it's all about. Now, the city was out here earlier this morning trying to get those burn marks off of the crosswalk, but those stains, as you can see right behind me, are still visible. The crosswalk did cause some controversy this week with some questioning of the $30,000 that was spent to create it. Dean, back to you. Okay, Stephanie, thank you. The city is still assessing the damage. APD has assigned a detective to the case, and they are investigating this as a potential hate crime.